Hey everybody, in today's video we're going to be looking at one of the most common questions I get on my YouTube channel and that is why am I getting text messages on my cell phone but I'm not getting them on my Garmin Instinct. Now I'm going to be using the first generation Garmin Instinct in this video. This video really should work no matter which Garmin device you've got because the things you're looking for are going to be the same among all of the Garmin devices. They're all going to connect to your cell phone the same way. The other thing I'll mention is I am an Apple iOS user, so unfortunately I can't speak to you Android users out there, but hopefully you can follow this video. Maybe there's some things that you'll get from it that might help you with your uh, issue getting text messages. So the first thing is let's send ourselves a text message. So I just sent myself a text message. Now I want to show you, I'm getting it on my cell phone, but I'm not getting it on my watch. What are the different things we need to go look at? The first thing I would do is go look and see whether your watch is connected to your smartphone or whether you've even got it set up for that. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by pressing and holding the middle button on the left side. That's our menu button. And then we're going to use the up or down button. We're going to go to settings, press the GPS button to select settings. Then we're going to go down. Again, using the down button to phone, press GPS to select phone, and we need to make sure that our status for the phone is on. So once I turn that on, we'll want to go down and we'll want to look at smart notifications, press GPS to select smart notifications. We also want to make sure that that is turned on. If you've got that turned off, you're not going to be getting smart notifications. Then you might need to look at some of these other settings. Do you want smart notifications during activities? Not during activities. And then what's your timeout for your notifications? So that's the first thing is we've got to make sure that we've got our phone uh, connection even available. So let's go ahead and let's press back. We've checked that. Everything's checked out good. The other thing we want to do is we want to hold down the control button, which is the top left button on the watch. You can see that I am connected to my smartphone. If I'm not, if it shows disconnected, press the GPS button and that'll try and make a connection to your smartphone. The other thing is let's go look for the moon icon and make sure that we don't have do not disturb on. You can see that I've got do not disturb on. Let's simply toggle that to off. So now do not disturb is off. So let's go ahead and let's go through here as well. You'll notice I also have the phone icon showing that my connected status. If you don't have that, I've done a video in the past that walks you through how to add that to your, your control wheel. Not everybody will have that option in their control wheel, but it's a quick way to just get to your phone and disconnect it or connect it. So now we've got everything checked. The only other thing I would do is if you're an Apple user, go on your phone, go to settings and Bluetooth and look for your device. There's my Instinct Solar and make sure that it shows it's connected. So that's one thing you want to look at. The other thing you want to look at is let's go to notifications. And depending on what you're using, most people are going to be using iMessages. So we're going to look for the icon for messages and make sure the notification center button is checked. You'll notice that I've got lock screen checked, banners checked, but I don't have notification center on. If notification center is not on, you will not get text messages on your watch. So now we've checked those things. Let's send ourselves a text message and let's see if we get it. So I'm going to send myself a new text message. You can see that my last one just came through and now this one came through as well. Test two and test two. So those are the different things that should get you fixed up for getting text messages that you're not getting on your smartwatch from your cell phone. I hope the video helps, but if you've got any problems, post them in the comments. Be happy to help you out. Thanks for watching.